So let's show that this polynomial f of x is irreducible over q extended by the fifth root of 2. How do we prove such a statement? First, we observe that the extension q by the fifth root of 2 has order as degree uh, 5 over q. In fact, this uh, follows by the fact, the observation that this field can be written as the quotient of uh, q, uh, say the polynomial ring q of x over uh, the polynomial x power 5 minus 2, which is of course, um, so x power 5 minus 2 is, uh, is a reducible polynomial over q. which you can prove, for example, by applying Eisenstein criterion uh, with p equals to 2, 2. Now, suppose, suppose that f, what would happen if f were um, reducible? It is a cubic f is a polynomial of degree uh, 3 and therefore it would split as the product of a polynomial of degree 1, a linear form, and a polynomial of degree 2, necessarily. Say one of these, L, is degree 1. So in this case uh, we get that f has to be a, has to have a root. So f has a root, say alpha, and I claim that this root has to be cannot be in q, but has to be in this uh, extension. We are of course supposing that f is reducible over here over this extension, obviously. And why I claim that alpha is not, uh, would not be a root in Q? Well, why? Because um, f, the polynomial f over Q is irreducible, as you also can prove by applying Eisenstein criterion with p equals to 2. So f is reducible over q, and therefore the extension um, by this root of q, since we have um, here polynomial f irreducible, which has alpha as a root over q, this as degree 3, the cubic. But on the other hand, this is a sub-extension, so it's a subfield of, of this fifth root of 2, and therefore by the degree theorem, of, or Lagrange, if you want, we get the, the degree of this one, which is 3, has to divide the degree of this, which we compute to be 5, and so this is clearly a contradiction, and we conclude that f is also irreducible over the extension q by um, fifth root of 2.